We need a fossil fuel free economy, period. There is no planet B. Well, I'll get a couple comments on that. We didn't leave the Stone Age because we ran out of rocks. We left the Stone Age because we came up with better ways to do things. Wind is now the least expensive form of, of renewable energy. Solar will probably get there if we make the investments, and I believe we're getting closer, but it's all because of the investment. It used to be really expensive, but we actually subsidized the research and helped create industries using some federal dollars, and now it's the least expensive. We know how to do this. But this takes bipartisanship, which is where I go back to my position as the number two most bipartisan. All of these things are gonna be extraordinary job creators. Now, I know climate change is real. I know that Earth will survive. I don't know if humans will. But the way to introduce this conversation to conservatives who we need to work together with is to remind them that this is also a national security issue. Why do we continue to reward our most fearsome adversaries? Iran, Russia, some of the biggest producers of fossil fuels and carbon energy in the entire world. We enrich them and then we spend a trillion dollars a year defending against them. I mean, are we out of our minds? This is a national security issue more than anything else. We would not be subject to the wars, to the staggering conflicts, and we would not be beholden to tyrants. Carbon fee and dividend is the only meaningful way a conservative proposition that actually puts a fee on carbon and returns the proceeds not to the government, but to the very people who will see rising prices because we're trying to disincentivize fossil fuels. By the way, they knew that by burning fossil fuels, they knew it would warm the globe and we would face a crisis. They knew this in, I think, the early 1900s. The conservative Republican Party, conservation should mean conserving the planet, right? Conserving the waters and the air and, the, you know, there's a way to kind of create bridges. That's kind of who I am. And it is not that difficult. We need someone, though, to bridge the two sides.